Scum by Lovejoy is a song I'm talking you through in this tutorial. Before I crack on with this video though, if you could like and subscribe, that would help me out tremendously. And if you want the full notated sheet music for this song, I'll also leave a link in the description below. So I'm gonna play the main sections up to speed first of all, so you can see and hear exactly what's going on, and then I'll break them down one bar at a time. So we've got this four bar intro, it does repeat itself a few times throughout the track. Have a listen, goes like this. Okay, so the first bar, I'm going crash and kick together. I'm going one and two and. All with my right hand, right, right, open hi-hat, right. And then we've got some 16th note triplets. We've got snare, 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 high snare, 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 floor, floor. All hand to hand. Lucas, they do, cause they do, cause they do, cause they do. In. Now Lucasade's triplets are swung. I find that Lucasade's helps us play this really well. Lucasade, 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 in. The second bar, pretty much the same, except we have different drums. We're going crash, crash, open, crash. Snare, 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 floor, 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 floor. Same sort of pattern. Third bar, same pattern as the first bar. One and two and. Lucasade, 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 Lucasade. And then the very last bar is one and two and three, four, the under, snare and floor tom together at the end. Let's do the four of these bars together in a row. One, two, three and four and. One and two and. Lucas eight, Lucas eight, Lucas eight, Lucas eight. One and two and. Lucas eight, Lucas eight, Lucas eight, Lucas eight. One. And two and Lucas eight, Lucas eight, Lucas eight, Lucas eight. One and two and three, four the under. You do notice that I do sometimes play different crashes. If you've got more than one crash, then it's it's sometimes easier, especially when you're kind of finishing down here. It's easier to hit the crash on the right hand side if you've got one. If you haven't, it doesn't matter. You can still play the crash where your crash usually is. I'm gonna go through verse one now. Have a listen up to speed, goes like this. Okay, it's a little bit tricky this section and it does differ very slightly, uh, certainly in the second time or the second verse, but it's pretty much the same. It goes, I'm playing kick first of all, kick to 30 second notes, right, left, right, kick, snare. So this bit's quite important. Kick, right, left, right, kick, snare, kick, right, right, left. That's the first bit. Kick, right, left, right, kick, snare, kick, right, right, left. The second part of the bar goes three E and a four E and a. Right, left, right, foot, right, left, right, right, left. Now I'm coming to my hand a lot of the time with my, uh, or should I say I'm coming to the snare a lot of the time with my right hand. So the first bar again, three and four and kick, hi, 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 kick, snare, kick, hi, hi, three E and a four, e and a one. The first, second, and third time bar is a little bit different. I'm going right, left, right, foot, right, left, right, left, choke. Choke is where you open the hi-hat and close it, in this case. And then beat four, and then two, 30 second notes. So that's first, second, third time bar. One, e and a two, e and a three, four, and are in. So you repeat them two bars three times. The fourth time round, we do the first bar and then we skip to the fourth time bar. The fourth time bar goes one, E and a, two, E and a, three, four. Let's do these two bars without stopping. 
three and four and kick right left right kick right foot right right left second bar one e and a two e and a three four and a and then it repeats some bars like i said three times around the fourth time you go straight to the fourth time bar the chorus is nice and simple we've got nothing for one bar it goes one two three four and then one two three four e and a snare and floor together and it repeats this four times round one two three four after three one two three four e and a four times round nice and simple verse two is pretty much exactly the same as uh, verse one except it goes to a kind of a rocky kind of rock beat at the end basically so have a listen to verse two goes like this Okay, so the first half of this is pretty much exactly the same. So the first two lines are the same, except from the second line down, we've got this little build at the end, snare and floor tom. One and two and three and four and, and then it gets to this rocky section. I'm playing crash, snare and kick. It goes one and a two e and a three e and a four e and a not easy you got a little buzz in there as well you want to make sure you hold the stick with your thumb and first finger and not too tight with the other fingers because you want the stick to bounce and that will happen if you hold it too tight you want it nice and loose so you can get that bounce but we'll get to that in a moment let's do that part again so the first part goes one and a let's do it again one and a the second part goes Two E and a. Let's do that. Three, four. Two E and a. Beat three goes. Three E and a. And then beat four goes. Both left, right, left. And that's where you have that buzz. Both buzz, right, left. Bar two, very similar. Bar two goes. One and a. Two E and a. Three E and a. Four E. And our last line goes one and a two e and a three e and a four e and a. And then we go to this half time. I think I accidentally played um, eighth notes with the kick, but it doesn't really matter. You've got one and two and three and four and in the very last bar one and two and three and four e and a. And that is verse two. Now I want to go to the guitar solo part of the song. This is on the hi-hat, the first bar with eighth notes. One and two and three and four and. Line two, we've got one and two and three and four E and da. So we've got that open hi-hat. Bar two, one and two and three and four and bar three one and two and three and four and one got them 30 second notes there on that uh fourth beat four one right right left right right left right is the sticking i'm using line three very similar one and two and three and four and second bar one and two and three and four e and da. so again we've got that for E and da, that closed open, closed open. The last bar, one and two 
and three and four and one. Got them 30 second notes again. The next line down goes one and two and three and four and. So this is where the song starts to build up the next bar. We've got 30 second notes for a whole bar. Three, four. The next line down goes one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one. So we've got them 30 second notes again. And then we've pretty much got 30 second notes right to the end. And it's building up here. One, two, three, four, one. It starts to open the hi-hat a little bit. So you can build that up. Um, the very uh, the, 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 the very last, basically the last two lines, this is fairly important because the first bar of the last two lines goes one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Then we have these accents. Accents are the arrows above the notation and that means play louder. So we've got this bar with these arrows and the rhythm goes, I'll do it with a closed hi-hat, goes one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. Right, left, 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 right, left. Right, left, 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 right, left. That's quite tricky. And the very last bar, we've basically got accents with our right hand. One and two and three and four and one. And then it, that's kind of it, really. Um, and that is it, basically, guys. It's just repeating them same bars. It is a tricky song. It's not easy. You do have to listen to this. And if you don't quite get it right, it doesn't matter getting note for note perfect. Keeping time is important, whatever you do, keep in time. But add your own things, take things out if it's a little bit tricky. Just build it up as and when you are ready. Don't forget to check out my other Love Joy and Wilbur Sert songs. I'll leave a link in the description below. I do have a playlist as well with loads of them on. Um, and also don't forget, Full Notated Sheet Music is in the link below also. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time.